Welcome to the three-dimensional computer graphics using OpenGL. This is the beginning of some epic fun. I love computer graphics and it's... Ah! Anyway, we're going to do some cool stuff on this playlist. Look, I'm using PowerPoint. I never use PowerPoint. This is probably the first time I've used PowerPoint in a video and most likely the last time, but I wanted to kind of give you an idea of the things we're going to learn. Not necessarily in this order. I was just kind of throwing up topics I want to cover and and here you go. So I'm going to show you how to set up OpenGL. Okay, most of the stuff we do in OpenGL you can do in DirectX. It's just a matter of looking up how DirectX does it. They name their functions differently and that sort of thing. First thing we need to do is get our data to the graphics card inside your computer. You got a GPU, a graphics processing unit, and most of the code we write will actually run on your graphics card. It won't run on the CPU. Up until now, if you haven't done any shaders, all the code you write runs on your central processing unit, but with OpenGL and or DirectX, either one, we write shaders, and shaders are programs we compile and run on the graphics card. Very cool, very fun. Here's a bunch of different types of shaders we'll write. We'll get to that. Probably the first thing we'll do is the lighting stuff. Add some light to our world, that sort of thing. Shadow, coordinate spaces. Again, I'm just kind of throwing these stuff up here. Uh, we'll cover it eventually. Um, let's see, environment maps. Fresnel, this is spelled Fresnel. It uh, has to do with reflections, kind of, and that sort of thing. We'll get to that. Bloom. Yeah, you can go Google all these words, but we're going to cover it. Okay, and a whole ton of other cool shader effects. And look at that, I even made the exclamation marks large for you. Okay, those of you following my channel, uh, you'll know I'm doing the Game Engine Programming Playlist. This playlist is far from complete. All right, I am still doing a lot in this playlist. In this playlist, the three-dimensional graphics using OpenGL, we're going to do a lot of niche things I wouldn't necessarily do in the Game Engine Programming Playlist. However, we'll rely on a lot of math that I cover in the Game Engine Programming Playlist, and I will reference the proper videos in that playlist as we go along. So that's, I think, if anything you get from this playlist, if all you want to do is graphics, is uh, learn your 3D math. However, this is a much more general game engine programming playlist. And for those of you watching my .NET video uploads, I'm still doing those. Don't worry. I, I uh, love .NET and that sort of thing. I'll keep pushing that. And other various topics that I have on my channel. But this is three-dimensional graphics using OpenGL and buckle up. <laughs> 